I tried to, but for some reason it keeps telling me that I have uh, an update for it, and I don't have an update, so I was going to try to see if there was something going on here. <clears throat> so let's try it now, we'll see if we can get back on here. I think my PTR might be bugged. I might need to do a, <coughs> a reinstall, but it's 14 gigabytes, so it'll take me a minute. Probably take me like 15 minutes to download that, but. See, it says there's a new version of Overwatch build. Please exit and restart the game to update. I keep doing that, so I can't get into the training. I can't. I find a group. See so, how. I'm gonna try to scan and repair just to take a look real quick. <clears throat> but for some reason, I can't try out Hammond. I'm really sad right now. I, I just downloaded the PTR just to make sure I could. Just to make sure I was able to do that, and I can't, as of right now at least. and change it up a little bit and we're gonna see if see if there's anything missing on my end I'm not really sure why I can't do wrecking ball right now <clears throat> panda how uh, how long do you think until somebody swings him it makes a meme with wrecking ball from Miley Cyrus I give it one day one as soon as he goes live instant there's probably already a meme about it right now, but <clears throat> guaranteed somebody's gonna make a meme out of that. But I am very interested in trying him. He says scan, yeah, scan complete. Check for updates. Up to date. You patch notes. June twenty eighth. Yep, that's today. Patch 1.26, and I'm on 1.26. So maybe log. I'm gonna sign out and say back in. See if that. See if that's the thing. Or I might switch accounts um, and just see what it is. <clears throat> I don't know. It's not letting me do it again. See, it's let. It just says that this is what's going on, and I can't. I can't play nothing. There's no training options. I've scanned, repaired. Exactly. It's gonna be Hammond came in like a wrecking ball. It's gonna be a play of the game too, or something like that. Um, let me switch accounts and see if that's gonna help. Switch over my GM account. <sighs> I don't understand. There he is. Hmm. It's starting to get frustrating here.
just like J-Lo Tell me what you want from me, I'll do it if you say so Cause you're the only one for me, I'm never gonna say no I found me an angel, I can see it in your halo Have you ever dreamt what we could do? Have you ever sent an I love you? I've never felt the feelings that I feel for you So maybe we can make a we of me and you I'ma treat you right tonight, let's make it last forever I promise you that no one else will ever treat you better And if you don't believe me, please see, I don't need no effort All you gotta do is flip that switch before we bet up Sorry, I'm trying to... <clears throat> I don't know, he could be a main tank in like a dive comp, if they ran like a triple tank, Winston, Diva, Hammond, um, and swung him in there as like an initiator. He's got 600 health, 500 health, 100 armor. Um, with his grapple mechanic, he can swing and cause impact damage. So he'd swing through somebody, swing up, use a slam, drop a shield, Diva, Winston come in, Genji Tracer all of a sudden dives a thing again. Because there's no way Baguette's going to be able to stand up to that. I mean, instant, you know, one stun, she won't be able to do it. They won't be able to focus enough damage with his um, adaptive shields. Um, oh, my God. Let's see. Baby. There we go. But, Panda, while we wait, I can look at the PTR or the patch notes and just kind of see what's going on um, with everything right now, at least on on ours, 25.01. Let's see. Yeah, LFG is a thing now. <clears throat> Doomfist's Meteor Strike. Oh, you got faster. Oh, was it? That was... This is old update. 26th? Yeah, two days old. Um... Waiting for the rest. The rest. Oh, he got a buff to his shields. Increased dead eyes. Increases range a ton. Supercharger for Arissa. Obviously the Symmetra changes, which are fucking nuts. <coughs> Lunar Colony switched. Bug fixes. Bastion back out to fix the bug. Well, that was weird. So I just moved a file. I think there was two conflicting files on which it was trying to uh, take a look at. Oh, thank you for giving me the notes. Oh, shit, the damage fall off removed? Oh, God. Oh my god, that's gonna be nuts. I did not see that, dude. Holy shit. That's a dramatic change to her. Absolutely dramatic. That was one of her, ma her major problems, is she was so. Thank you for bringing up the patch notes. Um, I'm looking at them right now. So, patch notes new here Wrecking Ball's capability, Ironclad, blah, 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 blah. He's going through Wrecking Ball. Learn more about Wrecking Ball, click here. Hero updates, here we go. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, so she's a Hanzo. Uh, I wouldn't call her a Hanzo. I mean, she does. She's going to be doing considerable amounts of damage. Um, but yeah, I would agree with her. With her crowd control ability and now long range. Excuse me. Now. Um, interesting. Um, but yeah, now with her crowd control ability and her having long range damage, she's definitely going to be a bigger factor. Oh, there's been a bunch of buffs here. Peacekeeper extended the range. Peacekeeper's range is extended. They're, they're giving everybody range now because of the sniper battles. Endothermic damage. I mean, endothermic blaster. Removed all damage fallout from her secondary fire projectile. Holy shit. Soldier's pulse rifle also increased range. So, um, a Korean soldier should be coming back now a little bit. Will's kiss now has damage fallout applied for automatic primary. Yeah, that... Well, that makes that makes sense. Fifty percent of max range. <clears throat> yeah, that makes Widowmaker a little more balanced. Cause it's supposed to be an SMG. It's not an it's not an AR. You know, it's not like an actual assault rifle for that. Um, but let's see if what we. 
That's interesting, yeah. So, uh, McCree's death, that's a huge buff for McCree. Come here. There it is. Um, that's a huge buff for McCree, considering damage fall off was his major limiting factor. That is mobility, obviously, but that's always been um, a limiting factor for him. Um, so obviously, Soldier 76, high ground presence now with the new Symmetra stuff. Uh, getting to places he's never been before, being able to use stack fights, or even, especially high noon. Think about high noon with an unlimited, virtually unlimited range. Dude, there's no place in the, in the map that's going to be 200 meters. Um, and using a teleporter to get up on some crazy platform or edge or lip and... You know, a widow will counter that pretty fast, but at the same time, if you teleport somebody else up there, a diva, um, a Reinhardt, a, a Bridget, even, um, something to give him time to, you know, zone everybody out or, or take advantage of his position. <clears throat> same thing for Soldier. You can't really challenge him that much, uh, especially with his maximum range um, being increased there. I don't think there was damage falls, a fall off on his ult, though. So that's it. But yeah, dealing with pharmacies will be a lot easier now, uh, considering the damage fall off. Um, <clears throat> Stormbow, Storm Arrow got nerfed. Uh, that's not, I mean, that's not really a nerf. Um, his new kit was powerful. So, you know, that's one of those things that it is what it is. Um, they did reduce the duration, which I don't feel is necessary. Um, I do understand that they want them to use those arrows faster instead of being able to take their time with the shots, which was, was one of his stronger abilities, especially like on a Genji deflect. I, uh, playing Genji against, you know, Hanzo was very tough because his. Storm arrow would outlast your deflect, and you know he'd shoot two arrows and realize you're deflecting. Or a good, you know, a good guy would just say shoot one, um, get you to deflect and dash away, and you've got five more arrows to use um, to put damage into shields, damage into tanks, damage into healers. So that's tough. Um, Panda, you know, uh, everybody says Osu helps, so I do recommend trying a little bit of Osu. Um, it's a, I think it's a free game. Um, I've played it a little bit. Um, I did, was never very good at it, but it did help my tracking. Um, so I definitely say try that. Um, take a look at. Uh, excuse me. Take a look at. Oh, all my links are broken. I need to fix those. Um, take a look at Osu. Uh, it's a it's a tracking game that um, make sure the most important thing if you're gonna do Osu is make sure your sensitivity is relatively close to the same. It doesn't need to be exact. Risk doesn't need to be exact. That's not that's not true. It's you're adaptive. You're a human being. It doesn't need to be exact. And we're not pros. Um, Osu, OSU. I'll show you. I think it's on... I'm not sure if it's on Steam. I think it's a third party. You gotta Google it. Osu is the game. Um, it's a, it's a, like a little Japanese weeb game, but um, very good for tracking, very good for that kind of stuff. So, um, starts off slow, good tutorial. You'll, you'll get the hang of it pretty fast. So I do recommend trying that. Um, other than that, just try um, at the... That's okay. Um, you know, one of the other things you can do that I like to do is... More difficult than it sounds. Uh, go into like a a game, take everybody's abilities off. You know, give a Anna and uh, you know, go to a custom game with you and two bots that can't shoot you. That is pretty low. Uh, I'm at I'm at six and six hundred. So I mean, I'm not. You're not really that far off. Um, and too too low sense, too high sense. It's all personal preference. Like Necros plays at a fucking unbelievable. He's like sixteen hundred DPI. And 15 cents. He like he's a he's a wrist player. So that, that's that he does a 180 like that. That's absurd to me. I played a much lower sense and do just fine. Um, with that being said, though, um, tracking uh, targets and not shooting. Try that. It's really weird feeling, but it's just to see tracking on. It's just raw tracking. There's no shooting. There's no compensation. Um, go into the game, they'll move around and just try to keep your mouse on. Don't shoot them. Take all their abilities away, take away primary fire, and just track them. Jump, shoot, jump and move and roll and use your abilities, but don't don't shoot. And then do that for a little bit as a warm up, and then shoot, and it should help. That's how that's kind of how I got better. Sombra now had last indefinitely. <clears throat> no longer can contest ob objectives while invisible. I do like that. Now that ability is a lot more devastating. But she can't just hide on point and cap. Like that's that's awesome. Enemy detection radius is larger, and she moves a little bit slower. So I do like that. That is a good uh, change for her. Translocator can now be destroyed, and last definitely, I do like that. That's more easy infiltration. That's a lot more flexibility. We'll probably see a lot of more somber play now. Um, Fitzy, Fitzy's probably having a heyday with that. All right, but let's uh, take a look real quick. Um, I'm gonna load this up. And see if it works now. <clears throat> the 
But Panda, thank you for uh, linking that in the Discord. I, I do appreciate that. It was very helpful of you. Should work now, I would think. I think it was conflicting. God damn it. I can't do the PTR. I don't know. Uh, it's not going to work for me, so we'll, we'll leave it as it is. We'll go fix my settings on my account, because I've changed some stuff. So I'm going to throw that on there. We'll, if I do a little bit of quick play, I'll see if any of my teammates are on. Um, we can always hop on do that, but we'll probably flex around and do uh, do some other stuff here. I don't know. It's, it's confusing. It, it might be bugged. Yep, yep, yep. There it is. So, hold on. I've got to. What's up, dude? Welcome back. Sound control six crosshairs. I'm definitely not doing that. Oops. Yeah, 60, that'd be great for him. I've got to, we're just hanging out right now, going over some changes on the PTR. I can't play Hammond. My PTR is all bugged out. I don't know what's going on with it, so I'll probably have to wait till an update or something happens. But um, as of right now, uh, just warming up. I do hate that flag, though. Okay, I forgot to finish this season with the, this account last time, so. Five, wasn't it? It was five. That's what my deep. Oh, this is supposed to be five. Five for everyone. No worries, dude. Uh, Nymph, it's okay. First time, first time for everything. I was just messing around with my GM account. I don't think I finished the season last season. <laughs> I didn't. Shame. Oh, this is back when I was good. Back in the day. And then the meta changed, and I put a lot of hog. I like this account to some people. So. I can't get the PTR to work. Oh, breaking news. Uh, there's a bug out on the breaking news, guys. So, that's a thing. So, I guess they're going to try to fix that.
But for now, I think, uh, Panda, if you have any more questions, dude, uh, feel free to ask away. I think I'm... Oh, here we go. There... Patch works now. So I'm going to try to update it and see if this is the patch that it's looking for. I've got to I see in the practice range, dude. Me. That was rude. Nymph and Panda, how do you like them? Are they weird? Do they listen to your conversations? Do they talk back to you? A new Sim is weird. A new Sim is very weird to me. She's fun to play, but I just I, I don't know if I want to play her. Panda, I'm actually having my mod work on those uh, this following week. I'm actually going to start revamping my Discord. I'm trying to be more active there because I know it's quiet all the time. I should have enough people in there right now to really commit time to it, but that's not fair to you guys. So I told them that we are going to be starting to have more roles and discords and channels and that kind of stuff. Um, that way I can kind of manage those things. Um, here, I'm going to move that so it doesn't look stupid. Ooh, Nymph, tell me how it is. Is that what you got with all your Amazon return money? For mod? What do you mean, can I try for mod? If you can't use teleport. You can, you, yeah, you can create a mass with a teleporter. Especially mid-fight, like rearranging a position for like a soldier or a McCree high noon. I've got to, if you did see, um... Yeah, during the team fight, it can. But for somebody coming back from spawn or reposition, um, a Korean soldier have their damage fall off reduced from 30% to 50 so that I still do uh, 50. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm revamping um, my... Uh, I've got two mods on there already. They're kind of going back through this. They're kind of conglomerating there um, in real life friends as well. So I might swing... I might pass it by them and see uh, how they feel about adding another third to... Can you code? Do you understand uh, Discord and setting all that stuff up? Because they are coders and one's a graphic designer too. So they're trying to do all that stuff for me. This is a garbage song. I've got a but her turrets are, are, are a new thing now. Flying through the air, they cause damage. Um, you can just shoot them at people. Um, and one of her most unique assets to me... All right, maybe this will work now. Uh, one of her most unique assets to me now um, is her ability to turn up her damage on shields. So, you know, she can burst up to like 60 damage a second on shields, um, winning a shield battle. So, you know, double shield or a walking tank or like a death ball are a lot more viable with her now, especially with her explosive right click. So, definitely going to be an interesting change to her. What the fuck? Come on, please. Yay, guys, I got it. Um, I think there was a, just a double feed. I actually had a game installed in two different places on the same drive. So let me fiddle with my settings real quick. Make sure my crosshair is the same. Listen. Actually, you know what? Let's just let's, let's change it up a little bit. We'll give it like a little fresh piece. Here we go. Yeah, pharmacy is gonna. Be, oh, true. There he is, guys. Hammond. Well, he doesn't do a ton of damage, which is kind of expected. He can't headshot though, so that's going to be an interesting play. Oh, do you have to hold it? Interesting. Sick dive tank. 
See, I don't understand. Do I need to hold that down to swing? We'll see. I think so. Nope, I missed. Okay. Woo! Dude, this is gonna be nuts. Also, it does get shorter as I move along. I wonder if I can, like, ring around the rosy. You know what I'm saying? Like, hook this and... Oh. Fuck off. Dude, he is fucking nuts! Are you kidding me? Doesn't have a lot of range, which is expected, but... Oh, so it breaks if you jump. I think you need to be rolling. That's probably gonna be fixed because that's kind of awkward to like try to do this and then hit it. The shields last for a pretty decent amount of time too. He's gonna take some getting used to for sure. But I still think his best his ult is going to be a absolute fucking area denial. Like, watch. So, you know, you're going to go into ball mode, right? You're going to be like, yeah, guys, okay, I'm initiating. Into the air. Initiate team fight. Throw that shit out. Boom. Pop all your abilities. There's no way anybody's going to be able to contest the point or contest you close up. Divers? Divers going against Hammond are fucked. Unless they catch him off. Uh, it's pretty short range. They need to kind of increase the range on that. He doesn't have a lot of spread though, which is pretty cool. I'm interested to see how that's gonna change. It just feels it feels weird. You know what I'm saying? Like it's not like a normal. That's a for denying a somber or something. That's gonna be nuts. The fact that he can get up that high and move is kind of nuts. Like, look how much health he can have. If he dies into a team and there's six people around, that's 600 shields. He can initiate like that on the ground, so McCree's fucked. So it's going to be an interesting uh, switch here. Dude, he's gonna be fucking nuts. Yeah, so if he's around six guys, he's gonna get 600 shields plus armor plus health. This is gonna be nuts. Especially if he's going in with all of his abilities. Like, he, this is gonna be an absolute engage tank, dude. Clear the, you know, come in here, teammates are around, pop up shields. You can move out, come back. That needs to be that needs to be more like Widow's Grapple. It needs to be able to have a little more range than that, I think. Dude, I wonder how SQC is gonna be playing with this tank.
Oh, they stick to walls too? That's gonna be nuts. Dude, he... I'm actually very excited about this. Because this is a tank I'll fucking play. Like, 100%. wonder if I can, like... Oh! Oh, fuck. That's gonna be... That's... Yeah, he, he has, he's going to have 100 armor, 500 health, he gets 100 shields per enemy within a certain vicinity. I didn't check the uh, actuality of what it is. Oh, see, so yeah, they fixed it, finally. Nobody was able to join. Um, 6v6, we're going to do no one. That's, it's just going to be a bunch of people playing against a bunch of people. <sighs> guys, everybody else who just joined, welcome to the channel. Uh, thanks for hanging out. I hope you guys are enjoying the stream. Um, if I do time requests, feel free to hang on chat. Uh, it is resub time for all those uh, who are normal viewers. Um, everybody else, we're kind of just going over the Hammond changes, or the Hammond. Uh, I'm playing Wrecking Ball. Wrecking Ball. Wrecking Ball. This is going to be such a clusterfuck, dude. Holy shit. My mic was on. So cute. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Can you roll straight into people, jump up, Q, finish off with minigun? I don't think so. You can't, because if you roll without the grapple, you don't do damage. Oh, you can throw yourself though. You can actually roll pretty fast. So if I throw myself around this corner, I can actually keep that momentum for a minute. Dude, he's gonna be fucking nuts. Holy shit, are you kidding me? Absolutely what that, disgusting. What was that? Oh, holy shit. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh my god, that's amazing. Is this guy really spamming we need a healer? Ooh! So I can hold on to it. And roll with it. Oh, I had E too. He does headshot damage, so. We're gonna have to see how this goes. This is so good. I feel like I can play this all the time.
Dude, he's gonna be so nuts. Uh, I don't know. I think I think being able to use it to engage. He's not very. He doesn't have a lot of disengage. Because rolling away, I mean, you could. It's not very jittery. It's not hard to hit. Um, it's a good mobility thing for him because it's he's a hamster ball. But I do not think it's a very good way to disengage. He's not a very disengage style hero. Oh, I'm fucked. I got really. You're gonna play Sombra. What does Sombra do against Hambone here. He's gonna get. I'm gonna sure. hack him out of his ball sure case. Of buildings. Yeah. Useful hack. Oh, his golden guns gonna be sick when they come out. But Hammond's gonna be a ton of fun. Maximum speed. Maximum overdrive. Yeah, the initialize is gonna be wood. Cause I just stay stealthy. No, he, he does not feel like a full game change. He does not. But he's gonna add a very unique element to the game, in my opinion, especially with somber changes. That's gonna take some getting used to. It's his roll mechanic. Whoa! Did he just blink through the map or something? I know. I would play. I wouldn't pick him over Deaver Winston. I would play him with Deaver Winston. You can't see his health bar, so that's bugged. But. I just wonder. That's pretty good. See, that's the engage I'm talking about. Three tank meta is going to be the thing. Because if people are getting good with that mechanic right there, the swing, land, and slam, like that's going to disrupt a lot of squishies. And if Hanzo doesn't have his double jump, he's fucked. So. Yeah, against a bunch of them. It's like laggy and weird graphics bugs. Holy shit. Yeah, yeah. somebody's invisible. I mean, I might be able to have alt here. <sighs> like my Shylocks. sombra abilities are lasting lasting forever. Really? There's no, there's no cooldown on them. There's well, there's uh, they last forever too. He's gonna be such an easy target to hit, though. Dude, Sombra is so crazy. It's just... Well, this dude's invisible as shit. Shit. 
Oh, dragon doesn't destroy the. <laughs> There's no graphic for destroying them either. There's no effect for destroying the mines. Dude, that's gonna be nuts. <laughs> Especially on point. Holy fuck! Holy shit, guys, that's gonna be well, weird. If um, like one, if they don't do 600 damage. Like a, a tank can. Take a big Walk through those, that's true, yeah. But squishies are gonna be Especially denied by area from those. Mm -hmm. well, you can shoot them, right? If we had a bridge, yeah, but it's, they, have a they have a decent amount of health. Yeah, they do. That's gonna be interesting. Yeah, I do think Bastion will be played a little, oh, not a lot more, a little bit more, because they they're gonna need damage to counter Hammond coming in. So that's gonna be interesting. 76 Widow Diva wins his most useful combo. It's his ground ult. No, I absolutely agree. 100%. It's a, it's a better Diva ult, in my honest opinion. So, I'm going to try some Sombra changes. I'm going to play some Hammond. I do like Hammond. He's, he's very fun to play. So, now I have three off tanks. I got, I got Zarya, Hog, and Hammond. But I'm not really sure what I'd consider Hammond. He's mobile like an off. He's a mobile off tank, but he has enough health to be a main tank. He doesn't have a shield. Um, people need to be like working around him to do it. So, he's gonna be fun though. Oh, we gotta play the new. Oh, I missed. No, let's see. Let's see how McCree fills against him. Double sniper will still probably be a thing. Uh, I, oh, they, thank you. That's why I was going to play Sombra. I am going to play the new Sombra. True. I, I've practiced at her to get better. Um, she just wasn't a hero that I liked. I didn't understand her mechanics well enough to play her at like a GM master level. Um, there's just other heroes that I was more proficient at, and now with that and lasting forever, and me being able to, to do this forever, and really sneak up, spray's still normal. That gives her so much more. Wow, her cooldowns are short too. Yeah, I think I'm. Well, I'm gonna try to. Try, I'm just gonna hack the shit out of their Hammond, because that's. I think that's what Sombra's balance changes are here now. Movement speed's been reduced. Yeah, I think so too. What the hell?
Oh yeah, that's what I do. That was bad play. I thought I had my thing out. There's some visual effects glitches, obviously, right now since this is the PTR. Oh, I thought I'd get him before Storm. Heck for Yeah, it is. That was bad play of Sombra for me. Sombra's a little bit like Tracer now. I want to see McCree, how he feels. I probably feel pretty good with the damage fall off now. Make the mines face upwards? That doesn't even make sense, dude. So you can't stun him out of it. Ooh! So see, McCree does feel a lot better. Um, I mean, just from one kill, obviously, it's not a lot. True, I do think, yeah. Let's start over at the beginning. Holy balls. Ooh, dead. Oh. Dude, McCree feels good. Doing that much damage from good range is really, really nice. I do not want to play Hammond, but. Why don't they just call him Hammond? Why do they call him Wrecking Ball? 
I mean, uh, they don't call Diva the name of her Mac, you know. If they did, it would make more sense. But I don't understand what this fuck this tree's for. Oh, he got the armor. And Brigade's there. Damage fall off. Damage fall off changed. It's no longer 30%. You only uh, as you only do 30% of your damage at max range. You do 50%. That's a 20% damage increase from max range. So, um, Ferrers are going to be a lot easier to deal with. So are, um, uh, what's it called? So are, uh, Mercies. Oh! Dad? Oh god, fucking shield. Exactly. I have a guy that that's exactly correct. I still fucking have a guy as McCree, but got unfinished business. Try hard? It's probably not gonna help with this comp, but Yeah, we lost this. Ooh! Did you see that stun? I recalled. Uh, this match is probably going to before I get to it. Yeah, I will see Soldier. Wait. Oh, I'm sore. I oh, dude, I bet Soldier's going to feel real nice. Because I was a Soldier main for a long time. Um, and then I switched to McCree because he had more punishing damage. Um, I always like burst damage. Mr. Tins a lot. I haven't seen you on in a century, dude. Welcome back. Do shit, cause yeah, dude, the damage fall off was gross. That's why a lot of people, you know, actually every single person who was any good at any kind of projectile picked Hanzo over McCree, cause with the damage fall off, it just didn't make sense. But now that that's been completely, virtually reduced to 50% damage, which is still a substantial fall off of damage, but being able to hit two, three shots at 50% damage instead of two, three shots at 30% damage. That's an effective 50 per. That's obviously it's an effective 50 percent increase in damage. Um, Tens did, yeah, I know. I, I didn't even finish placements on uh, Tendu. I was trying to give it to GM, so I, I was kind of a pain in the ass. Um, all the new changes are crazy. My widow's been good. I'm excited to start playing McCree again. Hammond is fucking nuts. Tens. Avogadro. I no, I was a soldier main. I was. I'm not becoming a soldier main. When he when hit scan was the thing. Um, I came from CSGO background, so that's that's kind of where I got that from. I just stuck to hit scans because they were easy. As Sir Tinslot, he's a projectile guy. Um, it took me a long time to get used to Hanzo, and then the buff in his arrow speed was a big, big help to me. Tins, if you haven't played him, dude, you gotta play him. He's fucking sick. He's really difficult to play. He's very he's a, he's the Genji of tanks. Extreme mobility for a tank. Um, he's his engage is off the charts. Like, you thought Diva Winston were going to be up in your face? This motherfucker can ruin your day. Well, I've got... You understand strategy, then. And that's that's the other half of this game. There's mechanical still. And there's understanding um, where to be, where to be, and how to how to use your abilities. So, uh, Tracer, Genji are still my best characters by far. Um, I've spent the most time on them. But I do want to see them come back with, like, a triple tank, single DPS, Tracer, Genji cleanup. Um... If you went, you know, I can't even think of a good healer to go with that because it's not Zen's not mobile enough, but he increases the damage output. Motherfucker, I waited. Uh, Widow got nerfed, but it's not really. I didn't. Hey guys, I called it. it. Wasn't even one day before somebody made the wrecking ball joke. Called it. I just wonder how long it's gonna be a meme. So that's gonna be interesting. It's so funny they're leaving because I wanted to play Hammond. I know I'm trying to I'm trying to get him, but everybody keeps fucking auto locking. See people keep joining and leaving, but oh no, that's what I was gonna play. That's weird. I've heard they do it in alphabetical order now.
What the? F oh, that's the. Have you guys seen this bug yet? He's uh, invisible somewhere. It's a. It's a glitch. Hammond doesn't have an overhead or a health bar either. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be interesting. I know I need to. I, I haven't actually moved all my stuff over to my M.2. I'm having a little trouble, so Josh is actually gonna help me out with it. Probably gonna do a fresh install of Windows on the M.2 NVMe, copy files over, and then reset, um, and then make sure obviously it boots because it's the boot letters that are the problem right now. So it's it's not detecting my V drive as a boot drive letter. It only detects C drive. So I should probably change my main boot letter to to something else, and then the other one is uh, obviously gonna be that. So. Oh, damage fall off. See, that's... He's going to be way more punishing now. Way more punishing now. Which, I'm going to be playing a lot more McCree now. Because McCree is one of my strongest heroes. Soldier is going to be more effective at pressure uh, than punishing. And, yeah. I don't think so, either. I've got no problem, dude. Go for it. I got a minute to get up here. Got you in my oh, she backed up. Hyper lol. Oh, fuck off. Do you guys see that there's a bug for him, for his uh, health pack thing now? I'm gonna get fucking wrecked. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, Panda. It's a it's a rocket jump off of the um, off of off of the bench onto that. And you don't have to rocket jump twice. If you get lucky, if you can catch a full sprint running up that ramp, you'll be good to go. Um, but yeah, on a, on a side map, I can show you. I can't get back there, probably. Are we contesting? Oh, did we win? Oh, they're not even... Dad? Oh! <laughs> Uh, Abigado, not, I mean, it's not a direct major impact, but he, they, both him and McCree are going to be much more effective, um, in the range, mid range, mid to long range battles, which is where they struggled over Hanzo Widow. Oh, she just booked it there. Oh. Everyone, heal up. He does, dude. Soldier feels better, like noticeably. Okay. I didn't think it was gonna be that big of a difference, but when you play him, he feels better. The, watching the health bars go down quicker and have it be less punishing is pretty crazy. Up. 
They have a Reaper now. That's a good pick against the Hammond. Easy clap. Oh. See, that's so confusing. He doesn't have a fucking... I'm dead. Oh god, those mines went off? Yeah, I'd run. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna have visor, but I don't know if we're gonna contest long enough. Hammond, swing in there. No, use your. That's not. Okay. Area denial. But he didn't use his shields. He has shields. Bummer. Dude, he feels good. You can now de destroy a translocator because it's permanent. Dude, Jug, Soldier and McCree feel fucking solid. I can't wait for... I hope those are live changes. I, I don't remember if those were PTR changes or not. But, dude, those guys feel fucking nice. Uh, oh, that's what I wanted to try. It was May. May has no damage fall off on her fucking right click now. Yeah, I, thought, I figured these were on PTR, but when these go live, dude, McCree is coming back into my arsenal. It's gonna feel good. We can play. I can play more mobile comp. Um, I mean, my widow's good, but I think my McCree is better. Only Sim is live. Okay, that's what I, that's what I figured. Because this just came out today, didn't it? Yeah. Jug, welcome back, dude. Good to see you. Oh, uh, tins. I just saw that. Uh, Droidicus is what you're thinking of. So I'm gonna see if I can't play. If I can't auto lock Hammond, I always forget where he is, like located on the. On the bar now that it's changed. Here we go. What the? Bad? <laughs> Banned. Banned from the PCR. There it goes. Sick.